welcome to a VEA training video. Today, I'm going to review with you how to fix the green LED on the stall side of your door. And that will be on the Elzor Flat Scan SW. On the stall side flat scan with bib switch one up, anytime that you're in the field, it's going to turn red with the LED, meaning it's getting a stall detection. The only time it goes green is when you're in the pink zone right over here. And that's only when the door is in movement. So let's go ahead and activate the door. So when this door is open, before I show you the green LED, I want to show a little demonstration. If there's nothing in the pin zone you can see, if your primary sensor harness is on the stall side of your door and not the approach, because it doesn't matter which side you choose to be the primary sensor, this harness may be in the pin zone, and that may be what's causing the green LED on the stall side of the door. Now I'm gonna let this door go closed and I'm gonna show you that green LED turning on. It's going to reactivate. So right before this door goes to shut, hand in the pin zone, it went green. Now imagine that that's your primary sensor harness. There are three methods to fix this problem. The first one, the easiest, is trim your harness. Make sure that when this door goes open and closed, that the harness is not hanging down into the pin zone. Just make it nice and snug when the door goes open and closed. Make sure that it's not in the field and it's not pulling on the sensor, but it's just right. Number two is dip switch four. That's what controls your pin zone. If and only if you do not need pin zone, turn off dip switch four. So I'm going to turn off this dip switch and hold down the learn button until that yellow LED stops blinking. Method number three is reducing the width of your pin zone via the remote until it stops seeing what's affecting the sensor. Now, before you program your pin zone, make sure that dip switch four is on. You wanna start with unlock. A is the width of your pin zone. Select that and it's gonna flash faster on the sensor. It's default to 15 inches. You have to hit a three digit code in order to program your pin zone in inches. Now, 15 is 015. Well, let's say we want to set it to 010 for 10 inches. Make sure it goes red, green, red, green, and that confirms that it hit the three digit code in the sensor and hit lock, lock. Make sure that in the end, you program your pin zone for what it needs to be set for and follow any local building codes that may apply. If these three methods do not work for you and you need more thorough troubleshooting, make sure to call the tech line for more assistance. But until then, check out the other troubleshooting videos on the YouTube channel if needed, and we will see you in the next one.